So us two, we are playing against them two, right there. Uh, yeah. They're, they're both lefties, so they've got backhands down the middle. So uh, we're probably gonna hit down the middle. I think so. I think so. Unless you have like some more. Well, I just hope it goes in. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's that's the first first goal. I yeah. Think. Yeah. All right. <laughs> all right, guys. First of all, me and my boy here undefeated on these courts over here, and. Uh, it's the biggest match of their life, but for me, it's a Wednesday night. Don't worry about it, guys. Right. Catch y'all later. Smoke comes every day. <laughs> Focus this this morning. Hey guys, this is uh, Wally here and Max, and we're gonna be narrating this righties versus lefty matchup. What do you think is the right thing to do here, Max? Oh, well, definitely going against lefties. I would always try to pick on their backhand. Oh Anybody's backhand, I gotta tell you. Well, why, why, is that, why is that different against righties? Oh, it's not. I mean, it's different because if you forget that they're lefties, you're gonna end up hitting it to their forehand and you're gonna get popped. So let's check out what's going to happen here. Look at this beautiful serve. I've actually never seen myself serve before. <laughs> oh. <laughs> look at that. I mean, that that approach shot. I mean, oh, look at that. That looked like a pretty dinky serve, <laughs> even though you say you don't know how to dink us. Oh, look at that forehand winner. Uh, OK, what can I do better with my serve, though, honestly? When you look at this motion, I've never seen myself serve before. Well, like I said, uh, most of the time, not on this one. Uh, let's see the replay roll. Uh, it's not going to yeah. be the serve. No, it's just a winner. Yeah, look at this sexy forehand right there, though. Yeah. I'm actually really proud of him because, like, uh, he's been only playing since January of this year. Uh, so it's only been, like, a nine months or so. And he's uh, improved a lot. Really helped him out with that. He used to be a high-level soccer player, so athleticism is there. But, yeah, tell me about the serve again. All right, let, let me look at it one more time. Let's see if you do what I tell you you always do. <laughs> your low toss. You're like 6'1". It feels high to me though. Look at that. Oh, look how tall that's. Okay. Look at that. But it <laughs> was out. Yeah. out. Alright, alright. I feel, I feel that. Look at the second serve. It's not fully extended. Like You're like choking on it. Mm. And you know, oh. I never really mastered that whole uh, strong slice serve, you know? It's not that much slice, is it? No. I don't know how you do it though. I think you told me one time, but it was... Um, Kinda See, me, I have a natural slice, but that's because I got my gimp shoulder, so <laughs> it <laughs> really that, cuts why out. Why does that give you a better slice? Because <laughs> I'm throwing it sideways, like, really. Hey, I think it's pretty good. It didn't slice, but it uh, <laughs> it wasn't bad. Oh, uh, why did that happen? I don't know. Sorry. I didn't get to see that. Oh, okay. <laughs> I wonder why that happened. That was a really bad back end. Actually, just got popped by the ball, guys. Ooh, look at that serve. Look at that serve. I think that was out. Because I probably would have missed it if it was in. <laughs> so tell but me. It's okay, guys. I just got lightly tapped, so I don't. I don't need no medical <laughs> services. Uh, you know, you can't afford it. Yeah. I mean, if it was Novak, I'd probably be on the ground right now. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, it's too soon. Man. <laughs> it's too soon. Besides, people who watch this won't even know what this is about. Okay. So it's funny. I was like, this guy is serving the lights out. I didn't realize he football like a mumble. <laughs> And I didn't realize he, uh, it was like the San Andreas fall, man. He's doing like a whole step inside. But you know, it's kind of a somewhat a common problem with people who don't really uh, play, uh, you know, with coaches and stuff yeah, like that. Yeah, like it's already stepping on the line. Which is fair. Hey, we got to tell them it's an act of love, you know, saving yeah. from all the embarrassment. But, um, you know, why do people do that? How do you fix it? I've already told you because I used to do a silly, happy Gilmore inspired serve. I used to do like a running start and hit it, so I would just stand back. I'm not saying that's what they do, but it's kind of on the same concept. You know, <laughs> I didn't even know you were allowed to do that. A running start? I thought yeah. you did really good. Oh. As long as you don't cross that. But I mean, you're going to tire yourself out a lot quicker in a match if you do that. Alright, that's a crawl. And a football. 
so he basically does his whole match. It's fine. Oh, look at this match. Oh, I got home. Look at Wallace sleeping. Know, he got, got caught sleeping. I know, but what can you do about that, right? I mean, you just gotta take it on the chin, right? Nah, oh, man, don't be sleeping. You were sleeping. Look, look, look at your racket. Look at your racket. Is it up well, or is it down? Watching. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, let's see what happens here. See, look how I'm ready. See, but for this you're already ready for a backhand. Why? Why not just be ready to be protecting yourself? <laughs> see? Oh, well, backhand protect yourself better than a forehand, right? Yeah, but. Hey, he... protect your body. Let's see here. But I just. Look at that. Ooh. But he got, he got backhands. Look at that. Awesome. Yeah, he knows. Who's this guy? Yeah. See, that's, that's the technical problem there, right? I guess, uh, I mean, then the guys should take a neck with this uh, down the middle and for both of hands. Uh, we were both out lucky, so. I felt like you were being nice though. Normally, if you're playing me, you try to hit me and vice versa. <laughs> I do that to everybody because it's yeah. an easier point. But the dude the net's pretty fast, so. Look at that. Ooh, look at that. Oh, look at that Baja. <laughs> Was he not doing enough with that volley there? Yeah. Uh, what happened yeah. there? Just a little bit of footwork, right? <laughs> yeah. I mean, like you were doing with Tommy, right? Pretty much tennis is footwork, man. It's like your upper body gets fixed pretty well, but it's really just about your positioning. Like that. Ooh, look at that. Ooh. Oh, look at that. Look at that backhand. That almost looked like he was going to hit him. <laughs> well, it's funny because we've been always telling him to get that two handed backhand. But, yeah, and look what happens when he does it. Uh, if he ever watches this video, he's going to hate it. <laughs> look how beautiful that is. Classic. And because he used two hands, people. <laughs> Not that one hand. So you, you don't like one hand, that hand? Oh, they're good, but you, <laughs> you should do it once you've had some practice with it, not just all of a sudden try to act like you're better. Yeah. Hey, but actually on a serious note, though, in doubles, is it wrong to hit it harder than that guy? Which should get in there. Oh, I always go for the neck. <laughs> okay. Is it right or wrong? I don't know, but... I usually like to think people won't try to return my silly slap shot I got. And even if it's going out, it's going so fast, most of the times they try to move out the way and they still hit it with their racket. So is it bad etiquette to hit it harder than that guy? No. Okay. It's totally fair. What about a mixed doubles? Hey, they knew, they knew the danger once they signed up. We should probably make people sign waivers. Yeah, that's true. Especially with me. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> because honestly, like at a higher level, you have no choice sometimes. I mean, these guys are just way too agile. The reach is too long. The height, I mean, they have vertical. You really just have to hit it at the guy sometimes. So I agree with you. <clears throat> I think if it's like super recreational and you know they don't know how to play, then maybe. And you know, actually here, doing a good job serving. Serving really well. Oh, yeah, man, he's got that steroid racket. He better. <laughs> no, he's using the ultra. It's not the steroid racket. Oh, he's is not he? using the hybrid. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> It only feels good though for serves. For ground strokes, I feel like I still hate like really weak with it. I don't know why. Yeah. Are you sure? Sure about what? But he's not using the steroid. Oh, what a nice. I'm on the field playing with them. I know we're gonna What a them. nice game. Yeah, look at that. Ooh, look at that. Oh. <laughs> and a That's tumble. Pretty That's pretty funny, actually. <laughs> I don't even know how that happens to you, right? Let me see. Well, he probably just tried moving out of the way too quick. Let oh, me yeah. see. Or did he trip on himself? Let's see. Nah, yeah, he just freaked out. He was like, screw this. <laughs> <laughs> it's not worth it. <laughs> uh, mamma mia. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Oh. Dude, oh, look at that. That cool actually looked like bro. it kind of hurt, dude. <laughs> that actually looked like it kind of hurt. Can't let them <laughs> <laughs> That's really funny. Yeah, so one thing you know about the gang, most of us are just really casual, never really had real lessons. We're just a bunch of hooligans. I like the aggression on that. Thank you. Learned it from you. Actually, I didn't because you never poach. <laughs> no, that wasn't uh, Don't say never. <laughs> That's true. When you do. I'm, you're telling me to have to carry people now, so I'm like, all right, I guess I'll yeah. try to. I don't like doing that though. Now, actually, check out this serve. It's actually pretty good uh, it's a lot of kick right well he double faults but it's generally a lot of kick <clears throat> do you think it's useful to do a righty kick serve against a left-handed player I really think it's I mean it might work sometimes but it generally is worse than not right I mean right well, yeah, that's, yeah. Oops. So you say I need to toss higher. 
Yeah. Or not just toss higher, but catch your at the full length of your reach. Because whenever you hit the whenever you hit the the serve, you tend to catch it with a bent arm when you should actually be full full extension. You mean <coughs> when I contact the racket? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Contact the ball, sorry. Uh, yeah. Can't speak English. <laughs> We're both immigrants too. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I made it. <laughs> Just in time across the border, so I'm a man. Uh, it's the year 2020, man. <laughs> Anything goes. <clears throat> okay. Oh, what a perfect love. Yeah. I don't think it was intentional, I don't but. Think it was intentional. <laughs> I think oh, it's look at that slack. You're always <laughs> sleeping. <laughs> I think uh, it's a great tool to lob over the net guy, but it's a lot harder than it looks, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> uh, you've seen some of the times where I set us up in a bad position. Yeah. <laughs> but you generally, what What do you think? It's better to do it with topspin, right? But the slice is too bloaty. Yeah. If there's no this match, you're pretty much done. So you got that. But then on a windy day, I would never recommend a lob. Really? <laughs> yeah. Actually, wouldn't it be better because it's harder to smash? Yeah, but then your ball will also get pushed more, depending on what side you're on, you know? Mm -hmm. Or it'll get pushed too short to where it's like, all right, don't even try. I guess you have better options if it's a uh, soft serve, right? Then you can maybe get a better return. Yeah. Yeah, so I noticed one thing about the blue shirt guy in the back is that he's definitely hitting a lot of slices on the returns. What do you think about that in doubles? Usually not going to be good right? unless you're really good at it. Yeah. It looks like he's probably booty tight. Yeah. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> Can you define booty tight? <laughs> it's a very no, PG. when you get it's a very uh, PG show, sir. When you're a little nervous, because some, I've seen him hit it. He's like a freaking beast. But you now some people just, I don't know. They they spaz out once it comes to matches. They're like, oh my god, I don't want to be responsible for us losing it. So how do you fix that? I don't know. I guess I was just always born with natural, you know, mental toughness. Mm -hmm. eh? <laughs> I agree. I think you just got to play more matches, right? If you can remember the score of what you played last week, you probably uh, don't play enough matches, right? So. Oh, what's this? Nice? Oh, yeah, it's nice. Look at this. Wow, look at that. Have you ever seen a forehand like that come from him? Just a normal just <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. That's funny. You and I, <laughs> you and I, Wally, are very shocked. <laughs> I mean, your partner, he, he has some very high, high quality shots, just yeah. randomly, just comes out of nowhere. You're like, where'd that come from? Right. I just realized that guy in the light blue shirt's a one-handed hunt. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> you mean the guy on the other side? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Well, thanks for tuning in, guys.